Hello viewers, welcome back. Today we continue with free energy research. This time we speak, as you see on the image on the right side, about Xuerua Huo magnetic power machine. So this is one strange looking magnetic motor that I suppose would never work, but let's see how it's different from the other patterns that I explored. So now I'm going to show you uh, and, and try to explain in all account what I did. Okay, first of all, we'll try to search and find this on the Google. Of course, if you write this patent, it will lead you to Google Patents page. And you can see now in the Google Patents page when this application has been made. It's of course a Chinese patent and you can download, download it via PDF, click over here. But when you download it, you get this. So basically we are speaking about Hohea Zou patent. And it shows here the, the rotor, of course, and there are, of course, some other variations, explanations in, um, uh, in text, how this should look like, a single rotor, double rotor style, and so on. And this is also the stator plus rotor, how this should spin. Okay, now we are in AutoCAD, and we have this in 3D, which is much easier to uh, try to explain how this generally should work. So I did, of course, always I make a housing and in the patent you will see when you open the PDF you do not have housing. But housing, of course, should be done so it can hold rotor and stator magnets. So this, basically these two sets, this would, uh, this would hold outside stator magnets and this would hold inside portion of stator magnets. And of course this shaft in the middle would hold uh, the rotor, rotor with rotor magnets. So if I hide now Let's say the housing, hide object, left grip, hide object, and also this isolate hide object. We are left with the stator and rotor magnets. And you can see now how they are positioned, which is strange. Yeah? So they are, um, they, are, they are positioned in a way so that, of course, uh, should repel itself. Yeah? From the rotor should repel, repel itself. The same poles are here, these S's with this black on the rotor. Yeah? So basically from the start, the rotor should repel itself because it's like, why, like poles. Uh, generally, the, if you see the, the stator magnets, so uh, if I make it this isometric on parallel vision, that's easier to explain. I make this and this is a parallel vision now. You can see if you look this magnet and this upper magnets that the, the, the lower magnets are smaller than the upper ones and this is exactly how it's shown in the patent so this is strange but should should affect somehow to the, to the strong to the strength of the magnets or something like that and the next thing is if, if i move this around i can hide of course now these sets of uh, uh, stator magnets and we are left with the rotor uh, i can leave this outside rotor also i can hide it and I can see leave one set. And they, you can see there are two sets of magnets. Uh, they're somehow shifted, yeah? but it's more likely parallel one to, to another, but a little bit shifted. However you look at it, and when you look at 3D drawings, you will see that this is the rotor magnet that should repel from the stator magnets above. Yeah? It does have sense because they are like poles, and this should work, but in practical sense, this, this would always stop. And that's why I never like this uh, this kind of approach. But all the, all the magnetic motors or magnet power machines work in the same way. So basically I can also hide this last one, hide object, and now we are left with the rotor and now you can see how this is set up. Uh, so there are two sets. It can work only with, with one set like this, with two sets, but this is like a double, double version with four magnets. And this is also probably something that increases uh, increases power of this magnetic power machine. Yeah? This is the rotor and the rotor looks quite quite uh, yeah, interesting and not, I didn't saw this I didn't see this version of patent in any other patent that I explore until now. I can unhide and object isolation I get and now everything. Yeah? So basically that's basically it. You see that uh, uh, that's basically a holder of the stator magnets and the uh, other stator magnets and the rotor is in the middle. Housing and of course what's not shown here is that the, the shaft would be of the rotor mounted to this housing below. Yeah? So, this, But this portion it, it doesn't have signs to show because now we are only interested and we are basically always interested how these uh, rotor magnets should repel from the stator magnets. 
And this is unique patent if you ask me. My dear viewers, this is the this is Quazo magnetic power machine. It's very different from the other patents. You can watch my other videos to see how this is supposed to work. But I'm impressed because I never saw something like that. But in my honest opinion, I think this would certainly stop after have not even start at all. But regardless, this is a very new patent from 2012. And yeah, I mean something might have happened in the meantime and Chinese maybe have found the solution. So regardless, thank you for watching and until the next video, uh, stay tuned on my channel. Bye bye.